The correct answer is, it means the filaments in the muscle slide over each other to produce contraction without changing their length. That is a sliding filament theory. When you look at the muscle fiber, inside the muscle fiber, there are two types of filaments. One is thin filament, actin, thick filament, myosin. These filaments, they slide over each other. Technically, the thin filament slides over the thick filament. By moving, sliding over each other, they're making the muscle fiber shorter. But we need to understand the muscle fiber becomes shorter, but the filaments don't change in size. So they don't become shorter, they just slide over each other. Because they slide over each other, the length of the muscle fiber becomes shorter, but not the length of the filaments. So the filament sliding theory, or sliding filament theory, it means filaments in the muscle slide over each other to provide contraction without changing their length. The other answers, they're all talking about changing the length of the filaments, which is all wrong.